Religion in the Middle Ages. In the Middle Ages, religious institutions worldwide had grown powerful and influential. This brought enormous benefits, but also led to corruption. By 1200, even the newest religion, Islam, was 500 years old. Religions had become major institutions and were established in traditions of every country. In many places, everyday life had become difficult. There was poverty and hardship, and those not suffering from these often experienced corruption and crime. Many religious people began to feel that it, it might be beneficial to withdraw from the world and worship God by becoming hermits, monks, and nuns. This made monastic communities attractive. In Europe, China, and Tibet, monastic traditions with their strict rules and simple lifestyles grew strong. Monasteries provided the local community with health care, education, employment, and refuge. They encouraged pilgrimages and provided positive influence during troubled times. Religious Power The priesthood was influential in politics as well as religion. In Europe, there was a rivalry between popes, kings, priests, and lords, and even between competing lord, popes. The church became corrupt. Priestly posts and forgiveness of sins could be bought. In Islam, there was no strong priesthood, but there are many different Muslim groups. In the Mayan and Toltec Mexico, priests were all-powerful and demanded blood sacrifice of their people. Worldwide, many people had a simple faith, but no real religious education. In Europe, religion was taught in Latin, and in India, it was taught in Sanskrit, languages that most people did not understand. Pilgrimage was important. Muslims went to Mecca, Christians to Rome and Jerusalem, and Buddhists to Hindu and holy mountains and temples. Many people could not improve their lives, so they paid for a better life in heaven. Christians, Muslims, and the Maya, or in the next life, Hindus and Buddhists. Around the world, great temples, cathedrals, churches, and mosques were built. Some of the finest architecture of the time. Religion and Culture During the Middle Ages, great religious thinkers were at work. Scholars such as Meister Eckhart in Germany, Thomas Aquinas in Italy, Maimonides and Ibn Arabi in Egypt, Marpa the Translator in Tibet, Ramanuja in India and Dogen in Japan shaped the ideas of the age. Religion became part of everyday life, affecting the arts and sciences, medicine, government, and society. It formed the heart of the world's many cultures, but there was a growing gap between what people believed and what they practiced. Some thought it was all right to pray on holy days and break the rules the rest of the time. Some temples and churches became so rich and corrupt that many people began to question their faith.